everybody and welcome back to my channel. Seems like it's been a while since I've filmed anything and that's because I've just been kind of busy, you know, full-time job and whatnot. Kind of sometimes makes me busy. I've got my full face of makeup on except I don't have any mascara on. And that's because I'm going to be reviewing this. The number seven extreme length mascara. It's not showing up. There we go. The best. There we are. That's better. Um, this was totally, totally an impulse item that I picked up a while back at Ulta. You know how sometimes the line at Ulta is like a million miles long and you know they stretch it back and you have to like stand like in an aisle. Well, a while back, um, they had uh, like one of those, it was a beautiful Saturday, we'd had some really crappy rainy yucky days and I think everybody and their dog was in one of the two Ulta stores in Des Moines, including me. And um, yeah, I was standing waiting in line, I already had a couple things in my little basket and picked this up just purely because. Uh, of course, now I can't find it on the Ulta app at all. I looked, couldn't find it. Um, I found it on Amazon. It's around 10 to $12. I can't even remember what I paid for this. I kind of threw that receipt away and I popped it right open and threw the package away. So yeah, because originally I wasn't even thinking of doing any kind of review on it, but I guess I'm going to now. So first off, I'm going to try, well, I'm not going to try. I'm going to put on my voluminous uh, base by L'Oreal. I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit. Got my mirror down here, so I'm going to be looking down so I don't, like, stab myself in the face. And, of course, Bilbo is on the outside, and my cat Thor is on the inside. If you want to know who Bilbo and Thor are, you can watch my Meet My Pet video. This is supposed to give, well, extreme length to your eyelashes. And mainly what I'm going to do is I will um, put it on. I'm going to work. I'm going to do a 12 hour. So I'll probably have this on for 13, 14 hours. Um, it is 4.30 or 34 in the afternoon. So I'm going to put it on. We'll see how it lasts. Because, you know, anything can look good for an hour or two. But if you're going to be work all day, you're going to be out all day, you're going to be doing stuff all day, and your mascara flakes off like crap, you don't want to wear it. it. It can make your eyelashes look great for an hour or two, but then you'll just save it for church or something. But here's what the wand looks like. Just, you know... It's a smaller wand. Sometimes I like the sw smaller wands because I can get in there a little easier, especially where I'm not quite as young as I used to be. So here we go. This feels like a pretty dry formula to me. Okay, uh... I don't see that it's making my eyelashes necessarily any longer, but it does make them look pretty good. Get a little on the bottom. Okay, let me get a little bit more for the other eye. Now this one does seem like it's a drier formula. Maybe that means I won't be like, you know, getting that, you know, you sneeze when your mascara is still kind of half damp and you end up with mascara all over your face and your eyes. Got one little minor clump, not too bad. Okay. That's what it looks like. I know you can't really... Kind of hard to tell in this lighting. So, it doesn't look 
too bad, I don't think. Um, yeah, not too bad. I, I don't see any extreme length. Um, sorry, but no, no extreme length, but it does look good. Uh, just based on what I've got on right now, it's not going to be my favorite mascara ever, ever, but it would be something I could grab. I just want to pop something on real quick. But we'll see how it wears, and I'll be back later tomorrow morning, because, you know, I work night shifts, so, yeah, um, it's 4, 4.30, or 4.40, so I'll probably be back around 7.15, maybe 7.30 in the morning. So I will let you know how this wears throughout a 12 to 13 hour shift, and about 13, 14 hours of wear time, so I'll see ya when I see ya. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, yeah, I know. I look kind of like, uh, and that's because, well, I've had this stuff on now for, well, it's, it is 718, so I've had it on for dang near 15 hours, and yeah, it was kind of a long shift at the hospital, so yeah, and I'm being blinded by the sun that's coming in. Nothing like trying to sleep when the sun's shining in your face. Not that I'm asleep now. I'm rambling, I know. It's it's just, you know, whatever. But anyway, let's get back um, to the review here. It wore fairly well. I did have, uh, you can see there's a little flake there, and it kind of rubbed off a little bit down here off of the bottom lashes, you can see. Um, but the top lashes wore pretty well. I'm looking in the mirror here. But it's, it's nothing special. You know, if you want just something to pop on real quick, give this a try. Wow, that's, that sun is bright! Oh, I hope my shades are drawn in my bedroom. Um, so if you want something, um, just to pop on, and you, you can buy this cheap, pick it up. Otherwise... It's really nothing special. Um, I doubt I'll ever buy this again. It was just kind of an impulse buy just to see, you know, hey, extreme length. I'll give it a try, especially when it wasn't like god awful expensive. But yeah, it's nothing special. It's okay. It's just not my favorite. And, and I wouldn't buy it again. So this is kind of like, meh. It's kind of average. And with that, I'm going to say peace, love. Take care of yourself. I'm trying not to blind myself here with the sunshine. And um, yeah, I'm going to go wash all of this off, brush my teeth, and I'm going to go to bed. And I will probably, hopefully, film another video later today when I'm actually awake. Bye-bye.